Hello everyone. Manchester United will face Everton at Old Trafford for Saturday's kickoff in the Premier League. Eric Ten Hag's men are looking to complete the double over the Toffees following the excellent 3 0 triumph at Goodison Park in November. It is the first of a double header against Merseyside opposition with Liverpool at the Theatre of Dreams in the Emirates FA Cup quarter final on Sunday, 17 March. After back to back losses in the top flight against Fulham and Manchester City, the Reds need to get back to winning ways to help boost our hopes of qualifying for next term's UFR Champions League alive. Here are all the latest and confirmed team news ahead of this crucial clash. Marcus Rashford and Johnny Evans are available to feature for Manchester United on Saturday, says Eric Ten Hag. Rashford and Evans had to depart the Manchester Derby early as they had been struggling with fitness issues but the pair have now recovered and are in contention to play against Everton at Old Trafford in the lunchtime kickoff. That means it will be a largely similar squad for the Reds, although Omari Forsen is absent because of injury picked up in training. Rasmus Hoyland will again miss out, although he trained with the squad, but he is not match fit. Eric Ten Hag hopes to have the Dane star crowned as the Premier League's Player of the Month, back for the Emirates for a cup tie against Liverpool, along with Harry Maguire and Aaron Wan-Bissaka. For next week, I think some players are planning to return, he said, so the process will continue like that now. Harry Maguire, Aaron Wan-Bissaka, I expect to be back for our game against Liverpool, same with Hoyland. While Mason Mount is sidelined for the clash with the Toffees, Ten Hag added that the midfielder is in a good spell and he hopes to return after the international break at the end of March. Tyrell Malaysia, Anthony Marshall, Lisandro Martinez and Luke Shaw are still injured. What are your early predictions for this crucial game against Everton? Let us know your opinion in the comment section below. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more Manchester United news and updates. Thanks for watching.